Okay, so there's been a few posts now on Facebook where um, people are using tripods and just struggling to uh, to get steady on them. So I thought I'd do a very quick video uh, just to go through what I do and how I use mine and uh, hopefully that'll be of some use to you guys. Uh, it's not necessarily the way forward, but um, it's just what I do. So it may or may not work for you, but it will, the principles are all the same and they work with uh, any of the um, tripod systems. This particular one, Recon, tripod from Scott Country. Um, as I say, you can use this with any any uh, tripod. Right, first thing you want to do is uh, make sure that you've got your uh, your pig saddle, your clamp or, or, or your Arca Swiss mount as close to the centre of balance of the rifle as possible. Uh, it's usually just forward of the um, magazine well. The other thing you want to do is set the rifle up so it's a little bit low so that you've actually got to come down to it. Uh, what I like to do so I like to have one leg of the tripod facing back towards me and then just step a little bit back from the rifle so you have to lean into it then you take your non-shooting hand thumb down grips the rear leg of the uh, tripod and then you lean on that and as you do so you're then bracing that into your shoulder The other thing you can do, if you've got a quick release sling like I have, you can take that off and pass that through the uh, tripod. Now this is one that's got the arm cuff in it, so that actually works quite well for me, so I'll put my hand through that. Put that, again thumb down onto the rear leg, and then by twisting that, that will pull the barrel down slightly. So what I tend to do is I tend to pull that down slightly to keep the barrel or the crosshairs just below the target and then lever against that down as I lean in and that gives you a very strong brace. Okay, uh, now obviously with closer range shots than that, the odds are you're probably just going to, if you're out in the field and that you're doing a bit of foxing or stalking, you're just going to put your uh, tripod down and you're probably going to end up staying side on and taking a shot because that's kind of a natural thing to do. But at 100, 150, 200 yards maybe, it's not really going to make the slightest bit of difference, so I won't worry too much, but these principles are definitely going to help you if you're taking longer shots, you've got something sat out, maybe 300 yards you want to have a crack at, uh, or a small target you're trying to hit, then uh, this is definitely going to get you more stable by doing this. Um, again, with uh, any type of shooting, the closer you are to the ground, the more stable you're going to be, so I'll always prefer, if I can, to sit down um, with the tripod in front of me so I can then use my rear elbow uh, to rest on my um, knees. So uh, yeah, well hopefully that will be of some use to you and um, best of luck.